Hi everyone, welcome back. Today's video is about lipsticks. I love them. They really make your eyes pop, your face pop, you feel a little bit more refreshed when you look yourself in the mirror if you've got lipsticks on. Uh, I've been into it since I was a teenager. I used to have Yves Saint Laurent's really super red or super pink. Nowadays I mostly go for natural sort of colours, sort of neutral pinks, neutral, a little bit beigey. Uh, the one I have on today is Ilias In My Room. I think I've probably gone through maybe 15, 20, maybe even 30 of these. It's beautiful. I think most people fit this type of lipstick. Um, if you're thinking of going more green in your makeup, a lipstick is probably one of the first things you should invest in because, I mean, you always get lipstick into your mouth, so you basically swallow it. And if you, your lipstick has a lot of toxins in it, then you'll get that into your body, not just through your skin, but also swallowing it. And then, you know, sometimes, oh, well, I do anyway, I, I reapply it several times a day. So, you do get a lot of the stuff from the lipstick into your body, so you want to keep it as clean and green as possible. The packaging is really satisfying. It looks nice, and then you've got this little boom. So I do recommend these. They're not super cheap, but uh, they're really good. I, I also use a lip pen just to draw the line. Um, sometimes a little bit before, and um, I go in afterwards and I apply the lipstick just to sort of try to perfect it a little bit more. And this lip pencil is by Lily and Lolo, which is also a green product. So you can use that without feeling bad. Uh, you're not going to get extra toxins in there. This one is called True Pink and it's a really good fit. So True Pink by Lily and Lolo and it's really good, it looks like this and it fits this lipstick really well. It actually fits all my lipsticks, I, I don't have loads of uh, lip pencils because I don't want to have loads of products. I want to have a few products that work really well, I don't want to have loads and loads of, of makeup, but I, I don't like that. But obviously with, when it comes to lips, you want to have you know, a few different lipsticks to sort of go with your mood. Another interesting lipstick is this one by Lippy Girl. That is a completely new brand to me. I was sent this and I thought, okay, I opened it and it looked really sort of like a pink, neutrally pink color. And then I put it on and it is such a cool color. It's quite dark in here today. I don't know what's going on, but can you see it's almost it's pink and it's sort of fairly neutral but it has that sort of neon type color to it there's a lot of blue color in there so i think that looks quite cool actually and if you're into really nice and different type of colors uh, for lipstick Go in and have a look at their website, lipigirl.com, because they have so many interesting lip colours. Sometimes when you look at, at green brands, clean makeup, the colours can be a little bit disappointing because normally they, I guess they believe that people want to have natural, neutral type colours. But um, So this one is a little bit different and I quite like it. Um, and they have loads of really interesting colours, like black and completely, yeah, loads. Go in and look, lipgirl.com. Another lip product that I use is this Lip Butter by uh, Pacifica, and it's this is in Shell. And this one I would use if I don't want to have sort of a makeup look, really. It's really, it's like a, a butter, it's quite sticky, and I would never use it with... Uh, a lip pen. It's not that sort of look. It's more like uh, sort of someday in your pajama or going to the gym, and you you want to look a little bit normal. Then I use this one, and it it's really sticky. Um, so it will stay for a long time. You don't have to reapply it. Hmm, it's quite nice. It's sort of satisfying. So for spring, I wanted something a little bit more fun. So I got um, a new one from Ilia. And it's called Wild Child, and it's sort of a 
corally, red corally color, but it's sheer. So it won't go boom on and you can take it down with, with blot it and, and take it down if you think it's too much. So I, I love that one. So let's see how it goes on. So loads of pigment, but still it's sheer. And it pops a bit. That's what I need. I need spring to start. I need some grey colours. I'm using the same lip pen. I quite like it. Um, it feels really good on because it's it's creamy. Loads of pigment, but still it, it doesn't dry your lips out. So I really like this one. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like and subscribe and uh, hopefully I will see you in the next video. Have a fabulous week. See you later. Bye.